How's your foot now? Yeah, well, not as bad. Hey, never mind my foot. You might have been burying me this morning. Oh, don't. Do you know I am slept for thinking about it? You haven't? Anyway, there's some chap coming down to interview me. Who? I don't know, some I with a fancy title. Well, you make sure that you tell him exactly what happened. I will. As long as they don't try and say it were your fault. Of course it isn't. Whose side are you on? Yours. Of course I am. Just don't understand how it could have happened. It happened because I wasn't given the care and attention I'm entitled to as a taxpayer. Well, a taxpayer's husband. It happened because they were negligent. So when's he coming to see you then, this block? This morning. Mr. Battersby. Andrew York, senior nursing manager. Oh, right. I'd just like to have a few words with you if I could about what happened last week. Oh, of course. Uh, if you don't mind, I'll tape it as well. It's just for our records. Is that all right? Yeah, sure. So, uh, Mr. Battersby, if you could tell me in your own words what happened when Nurse Platt and Nurse Delaney came to administer your painkillers. Right. Well, they came round with the trolley. Yeah. They got to me. And some, I don't know, I think someone was having a heart attack at the far end. And nurse, the other one. Delaney? Yeah, well, she goes off, leaving Platt and the trolley, and he gives me my pills. How many pills? Well, I'm not counting, am I? I just take what I'm given. Yeah, but was it your usual dose? Well, it couldn't have been, could it? Since it nearly killed me. When you took it, did you think it were your usual dose? I trusted him. I gather there were a moment or two when uh, Nurse Platt went off to assist Nurse Delaney and the drugs trolley was left unattended? Oh, I, I don't know. I wasn't paying much attention. You do know me and him about our runnings before. You and Nurse Platt? Oh, why? On account he got all snotty over his son marrying my daughter. Really? Yeah, there's been a lot said. Though not by me. I'm a peaceable sort of fellow. But Platt, oh, he got really upset. Said some terrible things about me and my family. I did wonder how we'd get on when I was first brought in here. But I thought, no. Give him the benefit, you know, see how we go on. And what happens? He tries to kill me. Well, let's not jump to any conclusions. Well, what then? While you've been in here, has Nurse Platt made any reference to your previous disagreements? Do you mean, has he threatened me? Well... Well, he'd have a smile on his face when I was brought in. Well, I. I'd be in his power, wouldn't I? He didn't have to say anything. I could see it in his eyes. Mr Battersby, when the drugs trolley was left unattended, did you help yourself to hope from it? Oh, is that what he's saying? It's a question I've got to ask. Of course I didn't. But it shows you what sort of a man he is going around saying something like that. I didn't say He that... tries to kill me, then covers his tracks by making out I tried to top myself. Come on, I mean, I might not have gone private. But I expect better than this. Oh, this bloke came to see you. Did he tell you what they were going to do? He said there'd be a full investigation and they'd let me know the outcome. I'll tell you what, though. They've suspended Florence. Martin Platt? Yep, because I said I don't intend him to me anymore. No chance of that, says the suit. Martin Platt has been suspended from duty. Well, there were imp rovers drinking at dinner time. Oh, great. That's what he gets for trying to kill me. Time off to go boozing. Hey, you shouldn't say that, that he tried to kill you. You don't know. Well, I know them weren't aspirins that he gave me. Oh, no. And I'm telling you this, I know. I'm going to want some compensation. And I mean real money. Because he's been paying and suffering. And I don't know how it's going to affect me in the long run, do I? I might have a change of personality. Oh, that'd be nice. I'd cough up for that. Hey, I'm serious here, Jan. When that fella came to see me, he didn't come to see me because he's worried about me. Oh, no. He came because he's worried about how much it's going to cost him. Hmm.